fuck that thing. Okay, so uh, let me watch my own cringy commentary. Here we go. That was really funny. Huh. I was spaced out. What? Yo, how do you think Force and Boys will do against Temple Storm? Your boys, Red Bull. Yeah, it could go either way. It doesn't. I don't know. I don't believe. Uh, <coughs> at, at top Hearthstone level, I don't really believe it skills that different. You know, it's just like. And these people are both uh, good at making decks. Gara prides himself on being like the that best deck builder ever. You know, but he kind of sucks. Right, anyway, well. if you didn't have lethal, just fuck anyway. <laughs> Yeah. Um. Huh. Definitely. Yeah. Shana swipe gets less sick. If that knife didn't hit though, he would go face and get raided by swipe. <laughs> okay, so you drew another wall, you know. Well, what here is? Sorry, yeah. I called her a he. It's a she. I'm so nah. used to saying he. And it's not looking too good. Yeah. He her next turn, but he said yeah. She. She. Hold on. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. okay, she gets up for her next turn, but it's not going to reduce uh. any cards. Anyway, I just you can't really judge anything by those two games because anyone could have played those two games and they'd go the same way. You know, they could switch places, and Forsen couldn't have done anything as a druid. So, it doesn't. You had a pretty good lineup. And uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see. We'll see. Whoa, mm -hmm. what's going on? I didn't see yeah. that. I, didn't, I was playing Final Fantasy VII. That's interesting. Uh, <laughs> uh, the what happened was. That was out of context. He said it happened yesterday, and I said I didn't see it. I was playing Final Fantasy VII. Yeah. 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 That's the best play. Mm -hmm. Oh. What the fuck? Was that just a misplay? Yeah. That was. All right, oh, Hunter versus Hunter. I wasn't, this... hmm? I wasn't watching. Did it start? Oh no, it didn't start. Yeah. Okay. Was... Wait, is this the only thing we're casting today? No, we're casting this in one more match. There's a Celestial versus Team Liquid. Which probably be closer than this match. Who's Celestial? But, I mean, don't give up. Don't give up hope. If you're playing yeah. Flame Waker and like, you have the opportunity to shoot like five missiles or something. Yeah, you gotta calculate those. You, odds. You don't, it's hard to know what the fuck percent. Oh, oops. It's hard to know what the percent. What the full percentage is. What the full percentage? Yeah. yeah. That's what we meant to say. Admitted to themselves that they think that they're underdogs in this league. Mm. Oh. My hair looks a lot cooler yeah, than really? it does now. Yeah, Gar was saying. Uh, he says, like, well, I think our team is, like, expected to finish 7th or 8th. And I think we're going to try to shatter those expectations. Well, let's see what my that's, turn. Uh -oh. that's what he said. I'm not saying that that's what everyone else thinks. But uh, that was kind of like the... They're, they're painting themselves as the underdogs. Because they're playing without Raynad. And Raynad's, you know, contrary to what people might believe... Damn, my hair looks way cooler there. That Raynad's actually what really happened? Popular. I think Link did my hair. Um... So, you know, they're playing uh, without their team captain. Link used to do my hair. And the president. No so it looks like they're going to have to shape it up myself. here. That's why I look retarded. I'm not, yeah. more, ba I'm not <laughs> more bald than I was there. You're contributing Link a lot. My to hair, dude. It, yeah, yeah, no problem. No, during the games I'm talking about. I also about, have the side angle going on. Maybe the side like, angle like, good. You know, there's all this hype stuff. Like, oh, I'm going to have to get rid of the Christmas Man, like this team is really up and coming. That angle is no good. Blah, blah, blah. And this guy's the best player on that team. And I don't care about any of that stuff. Well, unfortunately, that's what people care about the most. Well, let's hype this up. Let's hype this up. We, I just did, and then I asked you what you thought, and you're like, okay. I, I actually wasn't paying attention when you were talking, so then I couldn't respond. So then I just said it wasn't interesting. <laughs> I was like trying to open the stream so I could read the chat, because I haven't read the chat the whole time. Mm -hmm. And then uh, you were like, so what do you think? And it's like when your teacher calls on you in class, uh -huh. and you were, uh -huh. you were like in space. You're busy passing notes to a, a cute chick in, in cute like, grill, yeah. a couple, yeah. couple rows down. I like Play that conversation. More, I don't know. I'm fine with most yeah, of this stuff. I'm just giving an alternative. All right, all right. Or that there's more than one line of playing. There were like 70,000 people watching this. Sorry. Ancient of Lords is generally the most is the best, though. <clears throat> I think his logic also could be that based off the combat math, Emperor would also be easily destroyed by Swipe. Oh, that's my turn. Hold the on. Board. And this is the best way to deal with Sylvanas while developing true silver champion. Alright, space down. Hey, how is Emperor easily destroyed by Swipe behind the spell tree? No, because if he didn't have the True Silver Champion, then the Sylvanas would survive, right? Because he couldn't get through the, the Druidic Claw. So, so then... Okay. Like, how does he kill the Druidic Claw without suiciding both of his minions into the Druidic Claw? You need a True Silver Champion to do it. What is he talking about? Oh, yeah, you, you both. Neither minion dies the Druidic Claw, and then... Your uh, next turn, 
Next turn, your Belcher gets meleeed, and there's still an ooze. I guess, yeah. I mean, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, this white would have been an easy cleanup remove, I think. Uh, Wait, well, I don't even know what he was talking about at the end there. Eloise. Eloise? Uh, I couldn't follow that. Really? It's Eloise? I can understand if you said Elo like a Lois or something like that, because. Oh, no, man. Look at that name. What's it? That's Just a regular too many, name. There are too many vowels in that name. There are a lot of vowels. Four vowels. vowels. It's a lot of vowels. Wow. Four vowels is a lot of vowels. Life doesn't fit any. He doesn't have enough vowels. Yeah, he's got the weird Y going on like you. Hmm. I don't have a Y. Okay, so Eloise. <laughs> so Eloise. Jesus. Eloy, Eloise. Eloise. Needs to play Warlock yeah. now. Yeah. Like Lewis, right? But Eloise. Eloise. Yeah. E. Lewis. Something like that. Internet like, Lewis. I think this is entertaining. <laughs> Electronic. Usually Hearts Attorneys are so boring. I made it entertaining. I don't know. Plus, when I when I was actually talking about what it's happening in the game, I knew way more than Frodo knew what, what he was talking about, you know? Because I was, I was actually playing actively at the time. <laughs> All right, Electronic Lewis coming out with the Warlock. Don't know what's happening. He doesn't use. Actually, attack the Keeper. Fuck. It. Oh, I sorry. Uh, screw it. <laughs> Wow. So basically, it's two cards that are sitting I don't there. Like, by the way, guys, I actually don't care. No, you who don't. Series. I... Oh no, no, I definitely, do. I definitely don't bore about Frodo at Hearthstone. That's not even a question. He, uh, I don't know what you guys talk about. <laughs> For sure, like I analyze things a lot faster too. But he talks better. So talk, commentating is about talking well. I actually like that cast. When I'm listening to it now, I think it's fine. I don't know. I don't, I don't even mind it, but I mean, my personality is different than most people. So I, I look at things differently, I don't know. Let's watch more of this cast. Just wanted it to go to the last game. <laughs> so that's why Do I you really feel the need to keep clarifying that every I, I think I, everyone's going to be like, oh, they're just, you know, they're just Temple Storm bias, blah, blah. You care about, like, the 15 people saying that. I'm sorry. Yeah. I shouldn't. You're right. Yeah. I get trolled a lot too. You know, I, I'm bad. I'm bad against Twitch chat. They they farm me. They, just they farm you. We have. Oh, that's a perfect turn. Okay. Okay, so but next the... turn. Next turn, the other guy has 11 damage on board, and Savage Roar does 8, 19, 20 with hero power. Okay, so the yeah. other guy can't kill with the current cards. That was just okay. right, bad apparently because so I said the other guy. That wraps up our first match of the day. You look pretty tired, Reckful. <laughs> you all right, man? You hanging in there? This casting isn't for uh, noobs. Got to be the big uh, pros. Feels yeah. bad, man. No, but see what I mean? I'm like, I'm saying relevant stuff, but I'm just not saying it. Like I said, how much damage the other guy has to Savage Roar, so he can't kill him. You know. And then, uh, but the the bad thing is you're supposed to commentate a different way where you don't say the word the other guy. The words the other guy. <laughs> yeah, I was saying relevant stuff. I like this. Look, like here. Okay, so the other guy can't kill with. Like okay, I, I never hear commentators even talk about whether the other person has lethal next turn for some reason, or, and then the next two turns or something. Uh, very rarely, which is like something you should talk about every time. Next turn, but, the other guy has. But I just mentioned. damage on board, and uh, Savage Roar does eight, 19, 20 with hero power. Eleven on board with. Okay, so the yeah. other guy can't kill with the current card. Eleven on board because this grows for one. Okay, All right, so, so that wraps up our first match of the day. You no, look no, pretty no. tired, Reckful. You all right, man? You hanging in there? This casting isn't for uh, noobs. Gotta yeah. be the big pros. Uh, feels bad, like, man. <laughs> you're doing fine, man. You're doing a great job. Everyone will play every other team at least once. Or just once. I think that's the, the guaranteed round robin play. I spaced out there. Okay. Well, Rightful is uh, Rightful's, uh, kind of preoccupied, I guess, right now answering. Oh, sorry. Ad I, I, I was asking something about. No worries, what bro. We're doing. I got you. I was like tossing it to you. I was talking about Maz or something. Okay, okay. Tossing it to me. Oh, you want to go ahead? You go ahead. I'm bad at this well, in between talk. Okay, uh, now that's cringy now, you know, but this sure, is outside sure. of the game. That's nothing to do okay. with the game. Well, uh, what I'm supposed to do is ask you if you have any thoughts on that series. And if Spaced not, out, man. then uh, we just wrap it up and go to break and then we go to the next series. Oh, shit. So, what do you want to do, Rex? Well, this is. This is I forgot that my camera was over here. I put it back here. Okay. It's also my turn. Fuck, I only have like a second to play, probably. Uh, uh, okay, I move the window. <coughs> okay, uh, let me keep watching the video.
Well, my thoughts on that series are it's really too bad that Gara sucks. Yeah, it's really unfortunate. But uh, some people and are then, born with talent. Some people are born with hard work. I'm just trolling because Gara's then, uh, my friend. Thoughts on the next series. You know. Well, uh, I think the Asian people are going to take it down. Because mm -hmm. those are some strong Asians I've played against them. I don't even know who the other team is. I don't remember. I like that video. Okay, but some people were saying that it was racist for me to say that Asian people are going to take it. But that's not racist, you know? It's just like saying the, the it's just like saying the Europeans are going to win. It's the same exact thing. So the people who told me it was racist to say the Asians are actually racist, right? You never knew the casting was that bad, El Mayo. I don't know, man. I liked it. That's a, they, at some events, they like having casting like that. Like Seed Story Cup, you know, they had me casting it. I do the same thing, but... Then for that event, I, I guess they didn't like it. Even though if you're really good friends with Gara, you you went too far. It makes him look real bad. Yeah, not everyone knew the story that like I was playing a tournament, but it was also a Mazda's tournament. It was a Mazda's previous tournament right before that tournament. And I was playing with Gara. It was like a team thing, and he didn't show up. So I was I was just saying that because of that. He was like AFK, and I was playing by, by myself. There was two people, but I, at least I won th that series. <laughs> I would make a great counter strike caster. They bash people all the time. Uh, you have much better chemistry with Crip. Yeah, I casted, I like casting with Crip. That was a good day. And everyone liked it that day too. Except some feminists. Because I said... I said that... Yeah, I forgot. Actually, not everyone liked that day. Because I did say... Something about... Tides should let the girl win. So he can get the poontang. And apparently that was bad. <laughs> One of the staff people said everyone liked it except those pesky feminists. <laughs> no, but after that tournament, that tournament where I said the thing about tides, there was a Reddit post about how I was the best commentator in Hearthstone. <laughs> and it was the, the front page of the Hearthstone thing and everyone uploaded it. So I don't know, they went back and forth, man. They changed their mind after that. The next one. With Crip, everyone liked me. It sucked. This is during the commentary. We were both just trolling. We are wearing stupid hats and glasses and stuff. And it was a very troll. And then for, for this one, it was all serious.